Vaseline was born from petroleum waste. In 1859, 22-year-old chemist Robert Chesabrew traveled from Brooklyn to Pennsylvania, where the booming oil industry was drilling petroleum for kerosene. While observing the oil fields, he noticed workers complaining about a waxy, jelly-like substance that clogged their drilling equipment. They called it rod wax, a frustrating nuisance. However, the workers also discovered an unexpected benefit. When applied to cuts, burns, or scrapes, it seemed to accelerate healing. Chesabrew saw potential. He collected samples and spent years experimenting in his lab. By 1865, he had refined the substance into a clear, smooth gel, using filtration and distillation to remove impurities. He patented it in 1872 as petroleum jelly, but named it Vaseline. By blending the German word, Wasser water and Greek Alain olive oil, possibly adding line from his wife Carolyn's name to market it. Chesabrew famously burned his skin with acid or an open flame in public demonstrations, then applied Vaseline to show its healing properties. By 1870, he'd founded Chesabrew Manufacturing Company, and Vaseline became a household staple, even included in U.S. military first aid kits during World War II.